And over in Israel, demonstrators have gathered in Jerusalem to demand an end to the bombardment of Gaza. Representing a coalition of left-wing parties and peace groups, the protesters rallied outside the residence of Prime Minister Ehud Olmert. They held uh, placards with slogans like Stop the Occupation and Stop Firing. The Thursday's rally was the first pro-peace demonstration to take place in Jerusalem since the Israeli operation in Gaza started on Saturday. A poll on Thursday showed that 52 percent of the Israelis want the aerial campaign to continue, with only 20 percent would prefer a ceasefire. However, 19 percent also want to see a ground offensive, even though that would entail casualties in the army's ranks. In response to an EU proposal to end the violence in Gaza, Israeli Foreign Minister Tsipi Livni went to Paris on Thursday. She was hoping to discuss possible solutions with French leaders, even though France has just ceded its EU presidency. Livni was greeted by her French counterpart, Bernard Kouchner, on the steps of the LSA Palace. Later, she also met with President Nicolas Sarkozy. The French presidential office says Sarkozy will visit Cairo, Syria and Lebanon next week in an effort to broker a ceasefire. He is also expected to meet Palestinian President Mahmoud Abbas in Ramallah and Israeli Prime Minister Ehud Olmert in Jerusalem. Turkish Prime Minister Recep Tayyip Erdogan has met with Egyptian President Hosni Mubarak. A Thursday's meeting is part of a tour by the Turkish leader to work out an Egyptian-Turkish initiative aimed at helping to end the violence in Gaza and Israel. Egypt's foreign minister said on Thursday that Hamas must ensure the end of rocket fires in any truce deal that will halt Israel's assault on the Gaza Strip. And he criticized the Palestinian militants for giving Israel an excuse to launch the bombardment. The initiative uh, calls for a return to a Hamas-Israel truce and an international mechanism to ensure the opening of Gaza's border crossings. And on Wednesday, the Turkish leader also met with the Syria, Syria's president. He is expected to travel to Saudi Arabia on Saturday.